Karen Bensley. Welcome to Chow Time. Now the reason I call this recipe 835 bean salad is because when I initially came up with this recipe, I actually counted all the beans that went into it. It was kind of a slow day. Now this is the traditional three bean salad. It's been around since the 19th century, and it was very popular to take on picnics uh, because you didn't have to worry about refrigeration that much. It would hold up really well, and it became really popular in the United States in the 1960s. In fact, it was a favorite of J. Edgar Hoover, but it was not a favorite of mine because I thought this could use some enhancement. This could use some improvements. I'm going to start at the stove because I'm going to cook a little pasta first. And I wanted a very small pasta in this recipe. So this is a sini di pepe. And I'm going to do eight ounces of this. And this will take about uh, seven or eight minutes to cook. I'm going to salt the water a little bit. So we'll let that go. And while that's cooking, we're going to chop an onion. I like using sweet onion in this recipe. This is a Vidalia, uh, but any kind of sweet onion will do. put this in a nice big bowl. And now I'm going to open five cans of beans. Uh, in fact, at one point this was called tin can salad because you had to open so many tins of beans. But I have garbanzo beans, and I have green beans, and I have black beans, and I have my favorite cannellini beans. And then I'm going to take all these beans and rinse them because I don't like that gunk that they're packaged in. And we'll add these to the onions. My teeny tiny pasta is done, so I'm going to bring it over here. Rinse it in cold water. to the beans. It's coming together. And now for a very simple mustard dressing. Now the traditional one is just very vinegary, but I like to do kind of a sweet mustard recipe. So we're going to start with three quarters of a cup of extra virgin olive oil, half a cup of white wine lemon vinegar, two full tablespoons of a really good brown mustard. A tablespoon of sugar. And some salt and pepper. About a teaspoon, about a half a teaspoon. Add that to the salad and fold that in. Another option with the salad is you can crumple a bunch of bacon in that if you want to. But, you know, 835 bean salad is refreshing, and it's healthy, and it's so tasty. It travels well. It serves a lot of people. And let me take a taste. Mm. I like bean number 17 the best. <laughs> 